2004, as a part of the city's overall goal of increasing pedestrian and bicycle travel, the City Council of Arcata adopted a Bicycle and Pedestrian Master Plan. This plan included the use of a new and innovative treatment for streets to make a safer and more bicycle-friendly route called a bike boulevard. In 2006, the City Public Works Department applied for and received a State Bicycle Transportation Grant to try this new concept on streets which had lower vehicle volumes but were aligned with the places people wanted to go to, like the Arcata Marsh, the Plaza, Arcata High, the Co-op, and the Pool. The newly constructed Arcata Bicycle Boulevard on 10th Street and I Street are streets that have a special designation and a place in Arcata's overall strategy to increase bicycling alternatives or dedicated bike lanes or pathways are not proposed for residents and visitors. 10th Street was chosen specifically to create an alternative east-west route to 11th Street, which serves as the city's dedicated truck route and collector street in the core downtown area. By placing the Bicycle Boulevard 300 feet south and parallel to 11th Street, bike riders are removed from the busy street and allowed to make connections as necessary. Q Street was converted to a one-way street southbound only between 11th and 10th to eliminate motor vehicle conflicts at the 11th and Q Street intersection, which has been of concern with the cross traffic. Cyclists may ride on Q Street for southbound travel on this block and can also ride northbound to 11th on a new 8-foot wide shared pathway for pedestrians and bicycles. Previously, everyone, cars, bikes, and pedestrians used the narrow paved area to cross this stretch. The neighbors still have full access and on-street parking. One of the special features of the bike boulevards are special signs along the routes designating destinations and that you're on the Arcata Bike Boulevard. Large bicycle markings are placed on the pavement and cyclists are allowed full use of the lane and motor vehicles should slow down to the bicycle speed if they cannot safely pass the cyclists. On 10th Street going to the east is a busy crossing at K Street this project has installed a hand-activated rapid flashing sign to warn drivers on K Street a bicycle or pedestrian is in the crossing. Special bicycle markings placed across the intersection denote the bike's path of travel. One of the objectives in a bike boulevard where possible is to give the bike boulevard the through fare when at two-way stops. The Arcata Bike Boulevard switched the stop signs around at 10th and J and on I at 16th to reduce the bicycle stopping on 10th and I streets, respectively. One of the most notable changes is at the intersection of 10th and I, where it was chosen to construct a concrete bicycle wheel and hub, representing the intersection of the first two Arcata Bike Boulevards. This intersection remains a two-way stop as it was previously. An all-way stop and possible all-way yield were options which were not supported based upon the traffic counts and public input. Another notable change which has been widely appreciated is the conversion of the two-way stop at 11th and I Street to an all-way stop to give cyclists, vehicles, and pedestrians a safer crossing. Once you reach your destination, we have placed 14 new bike racks, enough room for 28 bikes, at the corners in concrete ball bouts at several intersections with no loss in vehicular parking. For more information, please contact the Public Works Department at 707-822-5957 or visit us at www.cityofarcata.org.